Your filter is critical to keeping your pool clean. So a dirty filter means a dirty pool. But with some simple regular cleaning and these step-by-step -step instructions, you can keep your filter system flowing smoothly. So here's how to clean your cartridge, sand, or DE pool filter. Check it out. Real quick, before we continue, if you want more help taking care of your pool, be sure to grab our free pool care cheat sheet at swimuniversity.com slash cheat sheet. It's totally free and will help keep your pool clean and clear all season long. How you clean your pool filter depends on the type of filter you have. So we'll walk through step-by-step -step on how to clean each type, cartridge filters, sand filters, and diatomaceous earth or DE filters. First up, how to clean a cartridge pool filter. This is a straightforward type of filter to clean. With a cartridge filter, you can usually just pull out the cartridge, rinse it off, and put it back. But sometimes your filter cartridge will need a deeper clean. So here's what you need to clean a cartridge filter. A garden hose with a spray nozzle, filter cleaner, a five gallon bucket, a replacement O-ring if needed, lubricant for your O-ring, a replacement filter cartridge, and your owner's manual just in case. Depending on how dirty your filter cartridge is, this process could be quick and easy, or it could take overnight. One, turn off your pool pump and filter system. Two, remove air from the system. Slowly turn the air relief valve, usually located on the top of the filter, to remove any excess air from the system. Three, remove the clamps holding the filter together and remove the top of the filter. If you're unsure how to open it, check your owner's manual. Four, Carefully remove the cartridge and inspect it for damage and wear. If you find any cracks or tears, or it's so dirty that cleaning won't help, it's time to replace it. We also recommend keeping an extra cartridge on hand so you can start your filter system back up while you clean the other cartridge. Five, it's time to clean the dirty cartridge. Use a spray nozzle on your garden hose and spray down the cartridge, making sure to get between the pleats. We recommend doing this once a week during peak pool season. You can also use a filter cleaner to get off extra grime and dirt. And once a month, you'll want to soak the cartridge overnight in a filter cleaner. Use a five gallon bucket, submerge the cartridge, and then rinse it off the next day. Six, when you're cleaning your cartridge, check the O-ring on your filter tank and lightly apply some lubricant. If it appears worn out, replace it. Seven, return the cartridge to the filter and secure it in place. Replace the filter top and close the clamps. Eight, turn the system back on and open the air relief valve to release any excess air in the system. Keep the valve open until a steady stream of water sprays from it. Nine, check the system pressure. If the PSI is off, you may have put the filter back together incorrectly. Now remember, you'll wanna spray your cartridge filter every week and soak it once a month. Keep two cartridges on hand and rotate in and out. And you'll likely need to replace the cartridge at least once a year, usually when you open your pool for the season. You'll also wanna replace it when it's worn out and can no longer be cleaned. Next, let's talk about how to clean a sand filter. You'll need to clean your sand filter in two ways. Regular backwashing, which reverses the flow of water in your filter, and a chemical clean, which you'll wanna do at least once a year. What you'll need is a backwash hose, sand filter cleaner, and your owner's manual if you have it. First up, backwashing. Backwashing sends pool water backwards through your filter and removes contaminants that have built up over time. The dirty water leaves your filter hose and pours out onto the ground. Now remember, when you're backwashing, you're gonna lose pool water, and that means you'll need to refill the pool and test and adjust your chemicals. So here's how to backwash your sand filter with a multi-port valve. Attach the backwash hose to the waste or backwash port and turn the filter system off. Then turn the multi-port valve to backwash and turn the filter system back on. Let the water run out of the backwash port and through the backwash hose for about a minute or until the water runs clear in your sight glass. Then turn the filter system off and turn the multi-port valve to rinse. Then turn your filter system back on and rinse the filter for about 30 seconds. Turn the filter system off again and set the multi-port valve back to filter. If you have a smaller or Intex sand filter, you'll want to backwash for one minute and then rinse for one minute. Repeat this cycle for three rounds to avoid blowing back anything into your pool. Now, when should you backwash your sand filter? You'll need to backwash whenever your sand filter pressure gauge reads 10 PSI over the normal operating level. It may also be time to clean the filter if you start to notice cloudy pool water or the pressure from your return jets is low. 
And be sure to check out our other video about when to backwash your pool. You'll also want to change your filter sand every four to five years. Now, once a year, you'll want to use sand filter cleaner. And here's how to add sand filter cleaner to your system. One, backwash the filter for three to five minutes to remove debris. Two, turn off the pump and turn the valve to filter. Three, remove the pump's strainer lid. Four, pour sand filter cleaner into the strainer basket and replace the lid. Five, turn the pump on for about 15 seconds, just long enough to transfer the cleaner from the pump to the filter. Six, turn off the pump and leave it off for eight hours or overnight. Seven, backwash the filter for three to five minutes again to remove dirt and debris dislodged by the filter cleaner and then turn the filter system back on. Lastly, let's walk through how to clean a DE pool filter. Cleaning a DE filter is like cleaning a cartridge filter and a sand filter combined. You'll rinse and then chemically clean it just like a cartridge filter, but you'll also backwash it just like a sand filter. So here's what you need to clean your DE filter. A backwash hose, a garden hose, DE filter cleaner, lubricant, a five gallon bucket, DE powder, and as an option, muriatic acid. You'll also need safety goggles and acid resistant gloves if you're using acid. And as always, your owner's manual will also help to have on hand. Here's how to clean a DE filter quickly and easily without using muriatic acid. One, backwash the filter for three to five minutes to remove debris. Two, turn the pump off and open the air relief valve. Three, remove the drain plug and let the water drain out of the filter tank. Four, remove the clamps holding the filter together. If you're unsure on how to open it, check your owner's manual. Five, remove the filter manifold and take out all the grids. Six, rinse out the tank with a garden hose. Then clean the manifold by using a spray nozzle on your garden hose to spray down the manifold, making sure to thoroughly flush the grids of all debris. And if the manifold is really dirty, use a DE filter cleaner. Seven, use a garden hose to rinse the filter grids, flushing out all debris, including the DE powder. Eight, place the grids back into the filter tank and add DE powder to your filter. You can check our step-by-step -step walkthrough on how to add DE powder to your filter on swimuniversity.com. So how often should you backwash a DE filter? You'll wanna backwash when your filter's pressure gauge reads 10 PSI over normal, or if your water is cloudy. But regardless of your filter gauge or water, you'll wanna clean your DE filter at least once a month. Now here's how to clean your DE filter with muriatic acid. You'll only need to do this once a year and usually at the end of pool season. And remember, muriatic acid is just that, an acid. So protect yourself by using goggles and acid resistant gloves. We recommend wearing long sleeves, pants, and closed shoes to protect your skin. To clean your DE filter with muriatic acid, you'll follow the steps from before. When it's time to clean the manifold, use the spray nozzle on your garden hose to spray it down, making sure to thoroughly flush the grids of all debris. Then dilute the muriatic acid with water in a five gallon bucket. Follow the manufacturer's instructions for dilution ratios. Place the manifold in the bucket, ensuring it's completely covered with the diluted solution and allow it to soak overnight. Afterwards, use a garden hose to rinse the filter grids. Finally, place the grids back into the filter tank and add DE powder to the filter. Now, if you want more help taking care of your filter system throughout the season, grab our free pool care cheat sheet at swimuniversity.com slash cheat sheet. And if you found this video helpful, leave a comment, hit the like button, and subscribe for more pool maintenance tutorials throughout the season. That's it. Thanks again, and happy swimming.